Wolf Blitzer breaks down Manti Teo's big interview today at 4 on CNN. Fight for gun control is expanding far beyond the nation's capital. A Missouri state senator is proposing a law that would essentially hold parents accountable if they have any guns in their homes. Now, under this bill, a parent or guardian of a child under 18 would have to notify their child's school if they have a gun. And the parent would be charged with a misdemeanor if they recklessly store the firearm so the child is able to get access and brings it to school. They'd be charged with a felony if the child injures or kills another person with it. The author of that bill, State Senator Maria Chappelle Nadal, she is uh, from Jefferson City, Missouri, and joins us. Um, first of all, why focus on the parents? Give us a sense of, of why you have decided that that's the way you want to go on this. Well, let me just tell you one thing. I live in one of the urban cities of America, and what we have been experiencing is a large number of youth um, either burglarizing homes or getting involved in gangs, and some of these parents actually know that their children are committing these crimes. And so I wanted to address this issue head on. I think that every single child's life is valuable and not one child's life is more valuable than another. And so I did want to put some accountability into the hands of parents. Let me tell you about what happened uh, right before we had Connecticut. We had in my school district where I also serve as a school board member, mm -hmm. we had a 12 year old kill a 12 year old. And after Connecticut, just two days later, we had a 17-year-old kill another 17-year-old. So I wanted to address this issue. It's, it's a tragic situation that's happening in your community. I know that there's some parents who are reacting to uh, this new proposal of yours, and I want you to listen. It concerns me a bit because I think the, the parents that would have no problem registering their guns are the, aren't the ones you have to worry about. Maybe a student uh, obtaining a weapon without the parent even knowing about it. I understand what they're trying to do, but making us notify them if we have guns is not going to deter the behavior what makes people do what they do with guns. Senator, what do you make of that? I mean, some of the parents seem to be a little, you know, peeved that uh, this would be a violation of privacy. Why, you know, why do they have to tell you about whether or not they own a gun or not? I mean, if they're responsible people, they're responsible people, they're responsible parents. They don't have to say anything. It's not, it's not your business. Well, absolutely. I understand where these parents are coming from. Here's the deal. Um, one of these parents who has a gun may be a victim of a burglary. And if that gun is stolen, it has nothing to do with the parent, but that gun is now in the illegal possession of a person who is not the owner of it. And if there is a crime that is committed, we just want to make sure that that owner is exempt you know, from that? anything happening. Okay. But at the same time, the school district has the opportunity to encourage and also educate parents on safekeeping of their guns. That's what we're trying to do here is to raise the consciousness of people and let them know that you know, mm -hmm. anyone can be impacted by this at all. You know, the 12-year-old who was killed by another 12-year-old, Grandpa yeah. left the gun out. All right. Uh, understand, certainly. I mean, that's a tragic situation. Uh, we'll be following the story to see how far it goes, uh, if you have the kind of support you need to push this through in your community. But we appreciate your time. Again, State Senator Maria Chappelle Nadal, thank you very much. Uh, Newark, New Jersey Mayor.